this sphere has custom normals. If you try to symmetrize this using Blender's Symmetrize tool, you will run into shading issues because it can't mirror the custom normals. MeshMachine's Symmetrize tool was specifically made for this purpose. You can run it from the Symmetrize sub-menu in the MeshMachine menu. Unlike Blender's Symmetrize tool, it will always work on the entire mesh and no selection is required. You can also use the Alt-X key combination to symmetrize across the X-axis. It's the same for the Y and Z axes accordingly. You can also change the axes or directions in the Redo panel. Custom normal mirroring can be turned off there as well. If you choose to mirror custom normals, you can select the pairing method. Index is the default and is faster than location-based pairing. But index may also fail like this, producing sharps and faulty normals. You could then either switch to location. Or, you could just run the tool with index pairing two times in sequence. Once. And twice. If your model has custom normals, where the center seam of the symmetrize operation is gonna be, you will likely get undesired normals and sometimes sharps. To deal with this, you can turn on the Fix Center Seam option in the Redo panel. It removes the sharps on the center seam, and can clear, or transfer normals. Use Clear, if you want to manually fix the normals. Use Transfer, if you want to transfer normals from the pre-symmetrized mesh. I'm clearing the normals on the bottom here, because I used the transfer option, and there happen to be sharps at the bottom. Check out the normal transfer and normal clear videos for details on this issue. I'm finishing by mirroring the plug subsets across the sphere. Check out the real mirror video for details on how to deal with custom normals in regards to the mirror modifier. <laughs>